Welcome to our first junior school e-newsletter for Term 2. I'm Anthea Jamison, Assistant Principal of the Junior School here at Hazel Glen College. We've had a very busy start to the term with the students engaged in lots of new and hands-on learning. In the junior school, the students have been focusing on our Australian history and the reasons we commemorate Anzac Day. Student experiences have included visits and talks from our war veterans, our annual college Anzac Day service held in the gym, the cooking of Anzac biscuits, and a visit to the Shrine of Remembrance by our Year 4 students. Our Year Level newsletters have been sent out on Compass. In these newsletters, you will find information specific to your child and their grade covering what's happening in all areas of the curriculum. Please make sure you get the chance to sit down and have a read. It's a great way for our teachers to communicate about the events we're having coming up at Hazel Glen and the focus of their teaching and learning. I would like to thank all of the junior school students who helped out at our open day last week. I continue to be blown away by how confident and articulate our students are. It's very obvious to me how much they love our college when I watch them taking parent tours, singing in our choir, performing in our college production or working in the classrooms. Congratulations and well done. Our annual cross country took place on Thursday. It was pretty cold when we started, but the students soon warmed up with their run. Congratulations to all the students for getting in there and doing their best. What a great way to stay healthy and have fun with friends. A very big thank you to all of our staff for their work, in particular to Jess Swingler, Tom Rolfe and the PE team who organised this fantastic event for our students. Next Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, we will have NAPLAN testing across the college in years 3, 5, 7 and 9. If your child is in these year levels, you will have received a letter through Compass outlining all the information you need. If you have any further questions, please don't hesitate to contact the appropriate year level leaders. On Wednesday the 10th of May, we'll be holding our annual Mother's Day breakfast in the middle school cafeteria. We would love to see all of our hardworking mums come and have some pancakes from us. We love to celebrate Mother's Day because we love to see the looks on the kids' faces as they sit and share breakfast at school with their mum or their grandma or that special person in their life. Now I need all the mums to, and grandmas to block their ears now because this is something that we don't need them to hear. On Tuesday the 9th of May we'll be giving the kids the opportunity to come along to our Mother's Day store and buy a gift for Mother's Day. Gifts will range between $2 and $12. Thank you to all the volunteers who are helping out on the day. Okay, you can let mum unblock her ears now. On Sunday the assistant principals will be working with Mr Furs down at Bunnings Mill Park cooking and selling delicious sausages. Come down and buy a sausage from us. All the money raised will go to our college and I can guarantee that you will never taste a more delicious sausage than one that's been cooked by us. I'm really looking forward to a wonderful term. There are so many exciting learning opportunities for our students. Have a fantastic week and I hope to see you on Sunday at Bunnings. Bye bye.